each other. That's right, Michael. And Kurt Busch once again is making headlines with that temper first on the racetrack against Jimmy Johnson. He just got us here, boys. Be ready. What a chump. What a chump. I got your number. I got your number. Then, post-race, that temper flashes white hot once again. You've got to see it to believe it. Thank you. Car's got a little damage in the front. How bad? The front end just fucked up. Uh, it punched the lower grill in a little bit. Looks like it raised the center of the splitter. It got run over. I thought it was gonna be okay. The 33 kind of cruised down the track in front of me there. Yeah, no big deal. I had a pretty good view of it here. We hit the wall. Big top. Get three sixteenths ready for the right front. The biter's gonna try and push the nose over. We need to be be getting it done here. Make sure that top of that left front's not gonna hit the tire, but don't pull out behind it too much. Let's get ready there, guys. We'll try to get some tires on it. Number one concern will be to get the tape off the grill. Let's put a string on the left. I'll get it straight. Grab the wheel. Straighten it up with the string. Let's see what we got. Just looking at pulling a little bit of that top of that left front fender. Just don't pull it too far. Just get it so the tire won't hit. Go look at the right front brake hoses, make sure they're not pinched. Make sure that the tires are clear, get the bare bond on, hood pins in and go. NASCAR has asked for... We got trouble, one car spinning in turn one, Casey Kane is around. We got another spin off turn two, Marcus Ambrose for a slide. We got wrecked. Right. Yeah, that was my ball again. Uh, probably should get more room of that. Trouble in turn number three, hard into the wall, and both grab the racing car. We're going to fix it, if they park it, they park it. The conflict is not over between Brian Vickers and Marcus Ambrose. Vickers now under yellow has come up and just hammered Marcus Ambrose. Just 83 just took him down. Don't, don't tear it up anymore if you can, please. Travis Quaffle goes for a spin in turn number two. He was racing Dale Earnhardt Jr. That fucker. Just don't I knew he was. That fucking prick. Fucker got what he deserves. He knows it. Back comes up, continues to lose ground. He gets pushed three wide now. Nearly got a piece of the wall. Keslowski bounces off him. Kenzo bounces off Keslowski. Kenzo's got a tire rub on the left front. Oh, man, it ain't my fault. The damn AC car ran us over. Inside, three wide. See the far right here. 33 is going to try and wreck you. We've got trouble again over to turn one. This time it's David Rudiman into the outside wall. He's going to hit me six times tonight. I don't even give a shit. It's a derby out here tonight. Yeah. Like a damn soap opera here. I'm just waiting for a ball to eliminate themselves. If we get any more action, that'd be pretty exciting. Might be the last man standing. See the moon up there. It's full. As the full moon rose, the stars came out to play. But two old rivals were no longer playing around. Jimmy Johnson goes for a spin, slides backwards into the outside retaining wall. Looks like the uh, 22 has the left front locked up here, Jimmy's why he got into it. Would he just get loose under the 48 and get into him? 22 and dump the 48. Kurt just dumped Jimmy? Uh, looked like that, but I don't know that he did it on purpose. With that caution we had earlier, where is that guy? Trouble in turn number two, Jimmy Johnson is around, Kurt Busch is around. What a jump, what a jump. How bad is it, Bob? Yeah, we probably heard it this time. Take it to the garage. Take it to the garage. You want something to eat? Want a knuckle sandwich? We've completed 300 out of trouble. Speaking of Kurt Busch, the driver of the 22 got into a heated argument after the race with Joe Menzer, a writer from NASCAR.com. Kurt had to be restrained by members of his team. Then Kurt's emotions spilled over into the media center as well. Let's take a look.
change starting between you and Kurt Busch. Well, I mean, just get right down to the point, really. Well, hopefully you'll stop running into my race car and we'll, we'll, everything will be fine. <laughs> Kurt said that he thought he's in your head. You'd been pretty good. I didn't say that tonight. You did not. Did not. Okay, I'll pull the transcript. Pull your Twitter. Pull your Twitter. I, it's not on Twitter. Okay, Facebook. It's not on Facebook. All right. You said we're in his head. Absolutely. It was on TV. Okay. When he came back to us, you know, you could see it coming. So I know that we're in his head. Thank you. <laughs>